Hello guys, uh, welcome back. In this video, I will show you how to upgrade uh, the AOS and a Cisco router. I have a, a Cisco 1941, and my customer want me to upgrade the AOS, you know, to a, a later uh, version. So let me show you which version is running right now. Uh, show version. <clears throat> so that's the version that is running right now, this one right there. So uh, basically, you know, we are upgrading um, to a later release. And um, I mean, he sent me, you know, the, U the, the, the operating system into the USB. So uh, I will show you how to do that from the USB in case you don't have, you know, access to a TFTP server or transfer the operating system from the network or boot the operating system from the network, which is also possible. So basically, um, I have the USB right here, and uh, let me insert that into the uh, USB port uh, right there. Uh, so something very important is that you need to format the USB uh, drive, pen drive, on the router because, you know, the uh, partition themes of the partition issues, if you don't format that into the router, it will be, you know, I have issues, you know, inserting that in the the, uh, the router doesn't recognize the partition. So it's very important to do that. Look at that. This is the USB flight at zero. So let's uh, go there. This USB flash zero. Enter. So he want me to upgrade to uh, this particular version right here. So let's copy that. And you copy a uh, copy a uh, USB flash zero to flash. And uh, this will take maybe you know like a couple minutes because the copies local is is you know it processes faster. Uh, enter and the source file name. This one right here. Enter. Okay, the process is uh, copies in progress. So the copy uh, is complete. Let's double check if the um, your operating system is there. Deal. Okay, so now we need to um, you know modify tell the operating system for which operating system we need to boot uh, because there is you know different operating system right here. You know this bird, this this one right here, for example. And uh, and this one right here, and you know we need to erase one one of them. But it's very important that you check, you know, if the operating system boot from the uh, from the version that the customer wants, because sometimes you know um, sometimes there is something happens, the operating system is not compatible, or it, the the image is corrupt, and then the unit doesn't boot, and then you need to execute another another uh, recovery uh, method. So that is very important to. Uh, check if the unit boot from there. So basically, we need to tell that this is the operating system that the router needs to boot. Configuration terminal, boot system, flash, and the operating system name. That's the command right there, paste. So if there, if there is any other instruction, you know, you need to erase that because it's not, you know, it will not boot from there. Uh, show run. Just to make sure that it's not, see, there is another uh, operating system right here. We need to erase this one because we need the the the, uh, the 153. So this one copy, and the way that you do that is um, configure the terminal. No, and the structure no both system flash and the operating system name. There we go. Enter. Exit. Uh, we say the configuration, great man, or uh, copy startup contact. Right man. Okay, uh, let's double check, check one. Basically, that's the, you know, the instruction right here. So let's reboot the unit in order to make sure that the operating system uh, is working. 
Another thing is, you know, uh, if you want to copy, you want to keep a copy of the operating system in your and your TFTP server, you can also copy from Flash to TFTP server. We can do that later. But first, let's check if we have connectivity. The one, the 16, no. 16, the one, the one, two. So it's there. But let's check if we can boot from the unit. We love. Yes. Unit is loading with the new uh, iOS image. So, guys, you know, look at that. The unit is booting from the uh, operating system. Let's make sure that the that's the operating system. It's correct. Enable. Show version. And yes, there we go. Um, this is the new operating system right there. So, show. Inventory. Show EMB all. Uh, then Lux number. Show license. And basically, guys, this is how did you, um, you know, upgrade your, the AOS, you know, in a Cisco router. And this is the model number right here. This analysis for router, but customer is still using it. So uh, we here and as seven network we provide the service. Well, guys, this is everything for today. Uh, thank you so much for your time. I really appreciate it. And uh, if you like the video, please subscribe to my channel and share with your friends and coworkers. Thank you so much, and I see you on the next video. Have a nice weekend. Thank you.